to my stream. I'd like to thank everybody who watches me on Twitch, YouTube, and Facebook. Let you guys know that you're much appreciated. An exciting moment here tonight, as finally we will settle some scores. The WWE Universe is extremely excited as we get set for WWE action. Tonight, the scores will be settled. Well, we get this thing loaded, we'll get it underway here. Let's see what happens. There we go. Here we are. Okay, let's get this match going. And on the other hand, you have an obsessive sadist in the form of Tommaso Ciampa, the superstar who will stop at absolutely nothing to win, no matter the cost to them or himself. I wish I could say you were talking in hyperbole this time, Saxton, but you're not. To think people actually used to affectionately call Ciampa the Sicilian psychopath. Sheamus making a move. Sheamus going for it. Oh, the arm's trapped. Oh, and a slam. Oh, and a knee. Hit another. Just endless knee strikes. Kick to the gut. Oh, brutal form. The Celtic Warrior firing on all cylinders. That's what he does. Keep on the attack. Launched. Tagged in. Tommaso Ciampa is the type of superstar you should keep an eye on. Not just because he's talented, but because he'll stab you in the back when you're not looking. You say that like someone can stab you in the back while you're looking, Saxton. It's physically impossible. That's not what I meant. Just laying it in. Ah, oh, he's in a bad spot now. Yeah, he's got to find a way out of that corner. Okay, right in the midsection. He's on his heels a bit now. This is not the time to be a hero. To keep this match from slipping away, he needs to get his partner in there and take a break. Somehow has to find a way to make a tag here. Completely agree. Getting the partner in here is absolutely vital. Look out, he's almost there. If he doesn't make the tag, they're in big trouble here, Cole. And he gets to his partner. We've got a house of fire now. A quick reversal by Sheamus. Ooh, what impact. Uh, knee right to the midsection. Look out! Ooh-wee! Sheamus finding a path of destruction currently. Sheamus looking a little shaken here. The beauty of tag team competition is that he doesn't need to take the entire brunt of the opposition's attack. Though the thought of making a tag doesn't necessarily appear to be on his mind right now. Absolutely has to make a tag here. Yeah, but that's easier said than done, Michael. Talking more about Ciampa's backstabbing nature, anyone in the Blackheart's orbit should know exactly what'll happen. But I argue that even knowing what to 
expect on that level. I can't prepare you for how violent and sadistic Superstar Ciampa is in the ring. Yeah, agreed. It's certainly an experience watching Ciampa inflict his particular brand of brutality on his fellow superstars. Ring rattling! And off the tag. Tag is made. Double team. Taking a swing. Drop kick hits the mark. The damage he's taking is starting to pile up. It looks to me like his partner's itching to get in there. And now might be a good time to give him what he wants. Desperately trying to get to the corner now. It's not going to be easy, though, Michael. And it's fired by Sheamus. Good grief. In a tag team contest, a superstar and Sheamus with the cover. And he breaks the cover. Hey, I guess you never know. Gets the tag. He might have been waiting on that one. He caught him slipping. Look at that power, Byron. Man, that was just careless intent. Too soon. Desperately needs to make a tag here. I don't know. It's going to be tough to make it to the corner. Are we going to see the tag, Byron? I think so, Michael. I really do. And there's the tag. Hits him with a gut wrench super. What impact. And set him up. Oh, oh it is. That's going to hurt. Tomasa Ciampa in quite a bind. His partner must feel absolutely helpless right now. The only thing he can do is stand there and watch his guy get completely decimated. Oh, what an uppercut. Sheamus gets tagged in. Ooh, jarring European uppercut. Picture perfect drop kick. Nicely done. Sheamus might want to rethink this showboating. Could come back to haunt. Oh, the home of slam. Whoa! Man, that was nasty. All he has to do is capitalize. This is... He can end it here! He's got him. No doubt it was a good one. Here's another look. Well, that was a great way to start. Get the first match out of the way here. Here are your That's winners, Cesaro and the Celtic Warrior Sheamus. The Sometimes you step in the ring and just refuse to lose. I think that's what we saw here tonight. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. You know what we got now? Our truth works versus EC3. Get this one loaded up. We'll get with it here. It's go time, fellas. And it looks to me like this entire arena is on its feet, and understandably so. Too quick to catch him there. Oh, oh he unloaded there. Corkscrew calf kick. Oh. 
Oh my God! Pendulum backbreaker. Tick tock. Watch this here. Truth with the offense. Look at this. Snap suplex. Ah, snap there. Look at it catch him off guard. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. Definitely has his work cut out for him. And look at the quickness by EC3. Wow. And our truth evades that one. What's he going to do with it? German suplex. How impressive was that reversal? Byron, what's a strategy that you'd employ against the top one percenter? Michael, I had a few matches against EC3 when we were both on NXT, and even though he was egotistical back then, he's somehow more deranged now. A guy that into himself can often let vanity take over and lose focus on a match. EC3 doesn't get distracted. His reflexes are in the top one percent. He's like a cat. The only way to beat EC3 is to be in the top nine-tenths of one percent. Middle rope, Ugh. missile drop kick. Hit the target. Our truth starting to stall a bit here. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Elbow drop, piercing. Boom, right across the small of the back. Hip drop. Horseshoe calf kick. And a quick pin attempt by our troop. And EC3 easily getting the shoulder up. He's hurting now. If he doesn't get out of that corner, he's gonna be hurting even worse. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Ooh-wee. A oh, foot just stomping down. And our truth evades that one. Oh, here we go. Oh, my God. Oh, God. What does our truth have to do with this? Will he be victorious? These superstars have endured so much punishment. Certainly looking worse for wear, but the tide can shift at any moment. Our oh. truth has the shoulders down early. A oh, kick out for EC3. Just barely. Maybe a figment of your imagination, but little Jimmy hurts. Cover, cover. Now let's look back at that amazing action. Here is your winner, R-Truth! Wow, big win right there. That's the kind of win that makes you feel good about yourself. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started.
Luke Gallows looking to do what he does best, beat up whoever's in the ring. And then there's the mustachioed mate across the ring, Trent Seven. Trent Seven's always ready to get down and dirty. In the British way, that is. What's the British way of getting down and dirty, Saxon? Tea without trumpets, fish without chips. It's been an elacious encounter thus far. The tides have swung in multiple directions. It's anyone's guess how this one's gonna end. Get plenty of fight left. Up. Just not enough damage done yet, Cole. Oh, look at the scoop slam! That's how you wear down your opponent. Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. Oh, look for Great evasion. Boom, oh, what an uppercut. Jarring. That's a good way to make your presence felt. Plenty of fight left. He is not going to go down without a fight, Michael. Man, Luke Gallows, what offense. Oh, look at the... Suplex. He's taking some good hits. No need to panic. He's still swinging. Oh, he's got him here. He's got him up. And oh! This arena has come unglued. You can feel the foundation shifting with every turn in the match. What's he got in mind? Big time gut buster across this quick cover from Gallows. And a kick out much to nobody's surprise. Nah, not yet. Too early. Look, Luke Gallows is on the attack now. Oh, the dreaded claw. Evading possible disaster there. The jumping complete shot. Wait, can he end it quickly? And again, he refuses to stay down. Yeah, seemed to be just testing the waters a bit there. Thrust right to the throat. Man can't breathe, the man can't fight. What a punch! Looking helpless right now. Oh, targeting the stomach. He's got him here. He's got him up. And oh! Hooked up and... Lightning fast reflexes. Someone call a dentist. Hit the mark with that one. Impactful. It'll jar your spine. What a chop! Oh, that'll light up your chest. Down to the floor. To the outside, which will start the referee's count. The jumping complete shot. Face first. Three. What a shot. That'll fillet your chest. Face first. Four. Back now inside the ring.
Gallo's able to get out of the way there. Nice little dodge ski. There he goes, crashing to the floor. The shoulders are down. And Luke Gallo just manages to roll the shoulder out. How did he do it? Textbook vertical suplex. Bam. Got the full Nelson. Slam! Luke Gallows is in position. Look out. Big opportunity for him now. I think here's the cover for the win. One, two, three. Luke Gallows wins. Here's another look at some of the previous action, giving their fans their money's worth and more. for him here in this one. I saw shades of all Tex Ferguson in that win here tonight. Two totally different human beings. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. to get undisputed. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing Undisputed Era from Vancouver, British Columbia, weighing in at 200 pounds, Kyle O'Reilly! Undisputed Era may just be unstoppable. There's always a question if you've achieved worldly success in sports entertainment prior to WWE, whether or not you can carry that success over, well, the Undisputed Era has proven not only can they carry that success, they have taken it to a whole new level. Confident, cocky, but they can back it up.
has just picked up. The man is alive. And his opponent from Paducah, Kentucky, weighing in at 190 pounds. Ricochet actually says that he, he loves to clear his mind and shove out the negativity so he can be fully present in the moment when that bell rings. Well, Ricochet is busy clearing out his mind so he can blow yours. This guy can do it all. The preeminent high flyer in the game lives for the adrenaline in his veins. This is about to blow your mind. With Ricochet in the ring, don't blink. You might just miss something. Ricochet's opponents tend to have to learn that the hard way. Part of the lawless outfit known as the Undisputed Era, O'Reilly is set to wreak havoc. Yeah, sometimes you need to go outside the bounds of the rule to make noise. Kyle O'Reilly knows that. Bodies have been decimated, fortitude has been tested, and these fans are showing their approval of these superstars' performances. Legs trapped. What's next? Oh, oh power. power. Thunderous power bomb. Oh, look at that. Scoop slam. Ricochet is like a real life superhero in the form of a WWE superstar. There is no way his opponent doesn't find that somewhat intimidating. Oh, it's very intimidating, Saxon. There's a reason they call Ricochet the one and only. No one else can do what he does in that ring. Ricochet comes into every match wanting to wow the WWE Universe, which is usually the type of thing I judge, but his high flying ability is just too impressive not to appreciate. Surely we'll see some of that high flying expertise on display here tonight. Surely, and if Ricochet gets to the top rope, which he most likely will, his opponent might as well throw in the towel. No one does it better from up there. He's looking a little off balance. He planned for this and could still rally. Multiple stops. Eight. Nine. Ten. And Kyle O'Reilly is your winner. A rare fail from the human highlight reel, Ricochet. Here is your winner, Kyle O'Reilly. That's a big win for him, ladies and gentlemen. Possessing the trait to cause carnage, pay dividends for Kyle O'Reilly on this night. What a way to kick off the night. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. All right, it's time to get this match going. 
And what about Asuka? You talk to anyone in that women's locker room and they will tell you there's just something about Asuka. Something that gives every match she's in that big fight feel, no matter the time or the place. And that's the aura of Asuka. No other superstar has what she has, and she knows it. Oh, look at this arm lock. Expertly applied. Hooked him up. High angle belly of back suplex. Oh, to the arm. Terrible. She's dazed in the corner there. Hooked up and boom, back drop suplex. What a high angle right across the shoulders. To the gut. In off the tag. Octopus stretch locked in. Whoa, impressive. You could say that again. I never thought she'd break free from that one. Oh, drop kick. Tag in. That's how you wear down your opponent. Beautiful drop kick. Asuka gets tagged in. Oh, stomping away. Comes in off the tag. Beautiful. Spear! And here's Asuka, in up the tag. And Asuka was able to get out of the way there. Oh, a series of brutal kicks to the body. She's got the shoulders down. She's got a long way to go before she should be thinking about a pinfall victory here. Needs to make it to the corner here, Corey. Oh, you're absolutely right, Cole. There's no way around it. A tag is vital at this point in the match. Gets out of dodge there. This is not where you want to be. She gets to the ropes. That's why always knowing where you are inside that ring is so important. She's looking at it early. Asuka gets the shoulder up. She came here to fight, not lay down. Looking to make a much needed tag here. And if successful, we may be looking at a whole new match here. <laughs> Snapmare. Oh, man. Not safe yet. Nick. Tell me what Asuka can do here to improve her chances. She really needs to make a tag here, guys. There's looking for the quick cover is Asuka. 
Oh, man, they don't even seem hurt after that. Clearly not enough damage done. Uh-oh. Belly to back suplex. Struggling to get to the corner here. Might not make it, Michael. And here we go. Oh, look into the armbar. No, she escapes it. Yeah, I don't know if she had it locked in fully, Michael. He's got him where he wants it, brother. Uh, power. Can she do it here? She got the shoulder up in time. Asuka always does her Japanese ancestors proud. To the midsection, double underhook. The old butterfly. Long blow. And here's a cover. Two count and a kick out. Too early for that. Not looking good, guys. Tag. Oh. Wow. Oh, oh. Really needs to get to the corner and make a tag. Otherwise, this match may be over sooner than later. We might just see it here. And this crowd's starting to perk up, Michael. Boom! There's the tag. Picture perfect drop kick. The fatigue is setting in for her. I really like the resolve we've seen from her in this tag team match, guys. Though, I wouldn't be against the tag here. You know, just so she can gather herself a bit. Oh, and a rolling neck snap. Great height, and look at that. Brutality. Submission move, submission move. Head scissor submission. Oh, the pilot princess walking the plank. I don't think Kyrie Sane can take much more of this. And that's it. This one is over. Let's take another look at these women in action. Extremely impressive win, guys. Talk about making your presence felt in a match. Wow, what a win. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. One of the most imposing figures in all of WWE. Samoa Joe will stare daggers through your heart before making it his mission to shorten your career. Here we go, fellas. I've been looking forward to this one for quite some time. In his time in NXT, Samoa Joe was a multi-time champion, but he also earned a reputation for his unhinged brutality. Does that make him a tougher opponent? It does, Michael. With Joe, you just can't predict his next move. Nothing is off the table. There are no lengths he will not go to inside that ring. We've seen Joe take his opponents to the limit and enjoy every minute of it. Some would call it gratuitous, but Joe doesn't just want to win the match. Joe wants to truly beat his opponent. 
And now here's Samoa Joe. Whoa, and a bit of a test of strength here. Controlling the tempo in full control. That's how you stop your opponent. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. That's all right, Cole. That'll hurt. DDT. Take your time. Enjoy it. Boom. Before the fist drops on your face. Look at this. Boom. Nice. And no luck against Joe there. Uh-uh. Not again. One of these competitors is eventually going to have to gain the upper hand. Samoa Joe looking a little startled right now. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. I don't know what he has planned out here, but he must be mindful of the referee's count. against Joe there. Uh-uh. From out of nowhere. Can he end it quickly? And another kick out. He's not giving up that easy. Tough spot to be in. Inverted suplex. Oh, well-measured strike. He's getting a little batter now. He planned for this and could still rally. Here it comes! Special delivery! Attitude adjustment! It's a wrap. Samoa Joe hoping to end it early. Let's look back on the action from the last match. Here is your winner, the superstar. Looking dominant at times in the victory. Rest assured, this was not a loss for Samoa Joe. It was a mere escape for his opponent. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. And with that, I bid y'all a good night. Have a nice day. We'll catch you next time.